Mabuhay and what is up tasters? Welcome to the first episode of Taste Collabs. In this video, I invited a few of my fellow content creators to share their YouTube gear setup for 2022. Prepare to get taste. The floor is yours guys. Hey guys, my name is Luigi Versosa and I'm about to show you my YouTube setup. But before we start, I would like to thank Sir Eden for including me on this video. I'm really really honored to be a part of this video and sana mayroon na akong ma-share sa inyo sa mga viewers na nanonood ngayon kung ano yung ginagamit kong machine or ginagamit kong mga gears for my YouTube videos. So my contents are about product reviews, mostly tech reviews. I also do cinematic videos and travel videos since I love to travel a lot. And I also do different kind of tutorials and tips. And lastly, I also do music or song covers. So talagang yung channel ko is halo-halo na and wala akong specific niche na pwedeng i-share sa inyo. By the way, let's go to my setup. So I am currently using the Canon M50 Mark I with the Sigma 17 to 50 mm f2.8. And it is mounted to the Zome video tripod which you can buy on Lazada or Shopee. And I am using the softbox light from Shopee that is only worth 700 to 800 pesos. So pinalitan ko lang yung bulb niya kung saan meron siyang warm option para naman magkaroon ng output na warm dito sa aking mga video and contents. And then next is my backlight or the one that I am using here that uh, helps on getting rid of the shadows and makes this outline of my right face. So this is the Ulanzi Vigim VL3 Pocket Video Light. And then next is my microphone that I am currently using. This is the CK Mova. SUM3 which is a USB condenser microphone and I also have a second microphone which I use whenever I am on a noisy environment or maingay yung ambient noise because this microphone has a built-in noise reduction feature and this is the Mirfac TU1 USB condenser microphone and then syempre meron din akong ginagamit na wireless microphone kapag ka nag vlog ako outdoors so this is the LensGo 348C wireless microphone system. So, wireless siya. Direct connect lang sa aking Canon M50 and I can use this microphone for vlogging. And then, this is my computer which is already a 5-year-old PC desktop computer and I mostly use this for all my content creation needs. Kahit gaming ginagamit ko to but most specially I use this for rendering the videos. And then that's pretty much my YouTube gears that ginagamit ko usually for my talking heads. But of course like what I said marami pa akong contents na ginagawa tulad ng mga travel videos. So mostly yung mga aerial shots na ginagamit ko doon is I am using a DJI Mini 2 drone. And again thank you so much Sir Eden for including me on this vlog or on this video. And again, uh, please follow all of the content creators na nandito sa video na to dahil meron silang magagandang content. Siyempre, subscribe nyo din lahat, especially kay Sir Eden. I-subscribe nyo yan. Sobrang solid yung mga contents niya. Anyway guys, thank you so much. Hello there mga tropang kahel. This is your boy JK of Orange Juice Stories. Thank you Sir Eden Sosa from Art of Sir Eden for inviting me to share my current YouTube setup. But before anything else, let me give you guys a brief background about myself. I work as a senior creator, senior videographer under an insurance company. I previously worked as an insurance sales trainer. Fortunately, I was given an opportunity by my company to explore and master the skills of video creation. This happened at the onset of the pandemic when I began to develop an interest and passion in videography and volunteered to create a video for the company. And the rest is history. Most of the things my team creates are video ads to help expand our company's reach and educate more Filipinos about our products and services. Sa channel ko naman, I create videos where I express more of my creative side. My recent works include narrative short films, product ads, and vlogging para mas relatable. It's for me to share my learnings and experience as a creative. Now, for my YouTube setup, it's actually quite straightforward and basic since I don't have a permanent place or a studio where I can set up all the filming equipment I have. And so, as much as possible, I only limit my setup to the three most important ones. First, sa lighting. What I use is a Godox SL60W as my key light 
paired with a Godox circular or rectangular softbox. I also use these cheap sunset lights. Yes, cheap yan! Nasa 150 lang ata yan sa Shopee. And lastly, I use a reflector para lang may pang-feel ako sa other side ng face ko. For my camera, I alternate between my Canon EOS 77D paired with Canon 24mm f2.8 prime lens para medyo wide or just like now, I'm using my new Fujifilm X-T4 paired with a 16-55mm to kit lens. F2.8 naman siya kapag 16mm so query lang and grabe sa quality ng footages ang nabibigay ng Fuji. I have a Desu R5 but I'm not using it right now because I can somehow monitor myself with my mobile phone kasi I can connect it to my camera. This can act as my shutter control na rin. Other than the camera, I also use a Desview teleprompter kasi kahit medyo sanay ako magsalita sa harap ng maraming tao, iba pa rin ang quality kapag guided ka by your notes or script. And lastly, hindi mabubuo ang setup ko without the audio. So for that, what I've been using mostly for my past videos, podcast sessions, and online meetings is the Mawono Ferry USB condenser microphone connected to my MacBook Air recording through Audacity. This is where I capture my main audio. I'm also using Lensgo LYM DMM2 Super Cardioid microphone attached to my main camera so I can easily sync my audio during editing. So there you go folks, this is my YouTube setup for the year 2022. I would love to see the studio setup of my fellow YouTubers here in this video. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel so we'll be updated sa mga happenings and future content. Thank you. Hi, my name is Sir Eden Sosa. I'm a graphic designer, content creator, tech enthusiast, and an aspiring filmmaker. My niche is mainly all about tech gear reviews, but I also do other varieties such as travel vlogs, vlogs, digital art, and a bit of software tutorials, short films, and reaction videos. Now, let's start with the cameras I use. For my main cam, I have here the almighty Canon M50, still rocking the Sigma 16mm contemporary lens, shooting in 180p, 24 frames per second, with an aperture of 1.4, and I'm currently shooting using the picture profile Faithful. Also, before I forget, I'm also using a teleprompter. This one is from Pronstoons, and I already rigged up using a magic arm here attached at the bottom of my tripod here. And sometimes I switch this with the LensGo teleprompter that I have. Now, for my B-cam, we got here the newest member of the family, the X-T20 by Fujifilm with the Sigma 17-50 using Fringer Pro I shoot in 4K 30 frames per second, 2.8 aperture, also in ProNeg film simulation. And sometimes if I need to use a back camera, I use my pretty old Nikon D5100 with the Yongnuo 15mm 1.8 prime lens. It is pretty old but it still works. Now for my audio, I'm using the LensGo KD95 that is directly connected to my Canon M50 here and the Daily D3 Pro on my Fujifilm X-T20 for audio syncing. Now for my monitor, we have here the Overwatch. With the OCT5 monitor, my only field monitor as of the moment, connected to my Shimbo Zoolink 600S receiver and the transmitter is mounted on the Canon M50. Now also attached to the Overwatch is my Zoom H1N with the LensGo 348C as my backup audio recording and I got here the transmitter attached to my chest. All of these are powered using the battery banks attached to the Overwatch. And moving on for my lighting setup, we got here the Yake Photo AK150W with the QDP70 parabolic softbox as my main light. And as for my backlight here, we got here the Ambitful FL80 RGB and also I use both the Ambitful A1 and the A2 as my accent light and sometimes I use that lamp over there at the back of the Mac, iMac rather as my practical light. And lastly of course I edit all my footages on the Adobe Premiere Pro and my audio on Adobe Audition. 
Hi there, my name is Junil. I make cinematic videos, product reviews, tips, tutorials, song covers on my YouTube channel. And my full-time job is a senior manager in one of the BPO companies here in Cebu. And thank you, Sir Eden, for making me a part of this collaboration video. Okay, so let me share with you my gear and setup whenever I make talking head videos like this. So let me start off with the lights. I'm using the Colbor CL100 bicolor light. And attached to it is a Triopo 55cm softbox with honeycomb grid. Moving on to my audio, I'm using the Mirfac N2 shotgun microphone which is connected directly to my camera. And speaking of camera, I am using the Fujifilm X's 10 with the Viltrox 23mm f1.4. And that's pretty much my setup. It's very basic, very minimal. Thank you again Sir Eden for inviting me to be part of this video. And to all of you who are watching this video, by all means, please subscribe to the channels of whoever is part of this video. It will mean a lot to us. And I'll see you in my channel. Magandang gabi sa inyo mga lamat ng YouTube. Welcome dito sa The Art of Sir Eden. Kasi nainbitahan tayo na ating kaibigan na si Sir Eden ng Taste Films para makasama dun sa My YouTube Gear Setup 2022. Tawagin nyo na lang ako sa pangalang Saru kasi or Kuya Saru or Sir Saru or kung ano man or kung basta kayo na bahala. Ang ginagawa ko sa YouTube channel ko is mostly product reviews pero specifically budget oriented products kumbaga yung mga abot kayang halaga lang or hindi aabot ng mga 10,000 pesos pataas aside from doon sa mga product centric reviews gumagawa din tayo ng short skits pero recently medyo nasa direksyon na tayo ng ano ng live streaming ngayon although hindi pa ganun kaganda yung internet connection ko tolerable naman at saka nagagawa ko naman yung mga kailangan kong gawin sa pagla-live stream so kaakibat noon ay syempre may mga gears or equipments na kalinya sa pag-stream or pagla-live stream Uh, so, ang camera na ginagamit ko is itong Rapusi 260 uh, Full HD webcam 30fps Yun Yan ang ginagamit ko ngayon Ito siya, yan o oh. Yan Aside from doon Ang aking uh, go-to uh, weapon of choice is ang EOS Rambutan EOS, EOS 650D Medyo luma na siya Oo, oh, alam ko Pero kaya niya mong gawin yung mga ipanapagawa ko sa kanya. Siyempre, kung may camera, kailangan natin ng lente. Yung lens na nakabit ngayon is uh, Tokina 12-24 f4 na ultra wide lens and then yung for audio input ay ang Boya BM3032. Meron din ako nung lens go na napanalunan ko sa uh, contest ni The Art of Sir Eden. And siyempre, ito yung nakikita nyo may ilaw. Ito ay ang JD950 courtesy of On Air Studios. Maraming maraming salamat din sa On Air Studios. Monitor na ginagamit ko is yung nasa kaliwa ko which is naka vertical orientation for streaming is uh, Pro Display P221 from HP na 23.5 inches. Eh, tingin ko sapat na siya para sa kailangan ko kasi Uh, vertical naman yung orientation na kailangan ko. Kailangan ko nung chat, yung OBS, eh, yung monitoring device ko, nandyan. Yung main display ko ay ang ViewSonic VX2776 SMHD 27-inch 75Hz sRGB na monitor. Bali, dito ako nag-e-edit, dito ako nagtatrabaho, dito ako gumagawa ng ano ng bagay. And then, syempre, dito rin, dito, ito yung main display ko. Yung ilaw ko ay isang ring light with a 2-meter stand from Shopee. Ring light siya, 26cm na ring light. Yan na yung sapat na ilaw na naka tingin ko naka 65% lang to na halong warm and cool tones para hindi ganun ka harsh yung ano hindi ako ganun ka itim so what you do for a living so nasa linya tayo ng creatives and marketing Uh, ang role ko is a multimedia designer for external clients. So, sa mga nanonood nito, uh, ini-invite ko kayong mag-subscribe dito sa channel ni The Art of Sir Eden. And syempre, sa mga co-content creators 
na nakasama ko dito sa sa privilehiyong ito please subscribe to their channels as well and syempre subscribe din kayo sa channel natin yan the, yeah ito po yung link youtube.com slash rtv channel alam nyo na yan I do streams on Facebook gaming so fb.gg slash rtv channel and then oh, minsan sa YouTube palipat-lipat lang yan sana punta kayo doon mag follow kayo like share alam nyo na the works manood din kayo minsan I play Apex Legends most of the time kasi yun lang naman talaga yung game ko eh again maraming maraming salamat Eden for this opportunity and yun as always hanggang sa muli maraming maraming salamat sa panonood peace hello 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 po ako nga po para si Irish Jaron isa po akong content creator dito sa YouTube and also sa Facebook so sa dalawang social media lang po ako umiikot maraming salamat po kay Sir Boss sa pag-invite sa amin dito especially sa akin hindi ko po expect na mapapabilang po ako sa ganitong kind of collaboration dahil alam ko at alam naman natin na mga kasama nating mga bossing ngayon dito sa video ay mga bigaten at sobrang gaganda ng setup so yeah hindi ko po alam kung paano ako nap- napabilang dito pero isang malaking karangalan ho sa akin dito at sobrang thankful po ako. Maraming salamat po ulit Sir Boss. Ayan po, ang YouTube setup 2022 ko po ngayon as of now ay ito lang naman. Ang ating main camera po na gamit natin today is ang ating Fujifilm X-T200. Kapag sa talking head videos naman po ang gagawin natin, ang laging nakamount po dito sa ating camera ay ang ating Fujinon XC 15-45mm kit lens. And mostly naman po ngayon, ang laging gamit kong lens ay ang ating 7R Sans 50mm f1.8. And ngayon po, ang ating microphone na gamit ay ang Mirfac Audio TU1. Yun pa lang po ang ating gears and equipment sa ngayon. Sobrang grateful and thankful po ako sa meron tayo. We're so blessed and I'm so grateful. <laughs> Pasensya na rin po pala dahil hawak-hawak ko ang microphone ngayon. Ayoko po kasi siyang sobrang layo sa bibig ko dahil sobrang river pa dito sa room. Hindi pa po namin siya naayos totally. So please guys do consider subscribing and following si Sir Boss dito sa YouTube and sa other social media accounts niya and also sa mga bossing na kasama natin today. Sobrang worth it and deserve po nilang masubscribe and ma-follow dahil lahat ng contents, lahat ng uploads na inilalabas at binibigyan nila sa atin ay sobrang best of the best talagang pinagpaplanuhan at binibigay po nila ang best nila para sa ikaka-enjoy at ikaka-satisfy natin. So maraming salamat po ulit Sir Boss sa pag-invite sa akin dito. Isang malaking karangalan po at yeah, thank you so much. Please stay safe and God bless us all. Thank you po. Bye bye. My name is Casper Nurgle and my main niche are reviews of camera gear and equipment for filmmaking. I am an educated engineer working as a project manager for Siemens Gamesa And in my spare time, I have a small film commercial company. Besides that, I create these YouTube videos. And I live in Denmark with my wife, our daughter and a small dog. My YouTube studio constantly changes depending on the creativity, my mood and which product I'm reviewing. Today's setup will look like this. I will now switch over to my second camera the Panasonic Lumix G85. I have now switched over to the G85 and now I can show you my rig over here. This is my camera rig. I know many of you would say it's maybe a little bit too much, but I like that I can have everything mounted to one rack and everything is done. Normally when I go to a client shoot, I will also bring a handle like this or a shoulder pad and a shoulder pad like this. We have this GH5 that I'm shooting on right here. I have the Metabone Speed Booster. Mostly in my YouTube studio, I use the Sigma 18-35 to with a variable ND filter from Freewheel. On the top here, we have a monitor from ESDDI, which is the main monitor that I have used. And I really see that this is very good. I have a monitor mount, a clickable monitor mount up here from uh, Vaxis. For the audio, I have the Rode Video Micro. And normally when I do YouTube videos, I use these small wireless microphones. And this is the Comicab Boom XD, which I'm using with the Rode, Rode Lab Go plugged into. I like this mic a little bit better than the original that is included with the Boom, uh, the Comicab Boom XD. Right now I'm using the Lensco microphones. I have it right here. 
plugged into the G85. If we keep talking about the audio, I have a Tascam DR60 Mark II on the back here. If we take a look around the GH5, I have a cage from Nicey Rig. I have a teleprompter. This is from Best View, this brand up here, and the design is not that good. So I redesigned this one by 3D printing some parts that I made in uh, on my computer. A um, case around here, so I can adjust this position to align up with my uh, my lens, and also the uh, the other position right here. Let's move over to the lighting. I am still using cheap LED lights from ESDDI and I think it works fine for me. But the lights I really want to use are the Godox VL150 or the WeLight Ninja 200. Uh, I have the P200 from Digital Photo. I have some pocket lights. I have the F7 from Falcon Eyes. I have a tube light here from Falcon Eyes, the Arisa 1. The LED bulb I have behind here is uh, bicolored so I can change uh, when I'm working, I can use daylight and when I'm recording these videos, I can make it a little bit more tungsten color. On the back here, I have a tube light, but it's a wall fixture. Before starting recording my videos, I use this cheap white balance card so I can set the right temperature in the camera and uh, I get some nice colors, I hope. I think that was it this time. Shout out to Sir Eden for making this happen and uh, I'm looking forward to see the other creators as well. And over to you. And that's it, Tasers. I hope you find this video helpful and hopefully you got inspired as well. Before I close this, I would like to thank all the content creators who participated. I am deeply grateful to all of you guys and hopefully we can do this again next year to see how our setup, channel, and skills have changed and grow. And please, Tasers, don't forget to subscribe to all of our channels. Links are in the description below. And again, this is Taze or The Art of Sir Eden, and together, let's explore, learn, create, and share. See you on my next video. Taze Collabs, out.